Hi, I'm Eric Hartz with Nexus Circular. I'm gonna briefly explain advanced recycling and how we're addressing the plastics challenge. So what is plastic? Plastic is a long chain hydrocarbon made from extracted oil and gas. You've seen it in gasoline, for instance. It's like Legos, where the pieces all come together in one stack or in one long chain. So traditionally, plastics are made from the extracted oil and gas, are sent to plastic resin producers that do a process called cracking. They make resins that they then turn into packaging that consumers use and hopefully recycle. Advanced recycling takes the place of the extracted oil and gas. Instead, used plastics, those long chain hydrocarbons from our Lego exhibit earlier, are broken down back to their original components using pyrolysis, which is heat in the absence of oxygen. They in turn run through the same exact process as traditional plastic manufacturing being cracked back into new plastics. The difference is those molecules came from recycled plastic as opposed to out of the ground. So let's take this up a level. What do we do at Nexus? At Nexus, you see the used plastics. That's a picture of our warehouse and the plastics that we store. Next are the vessels where we do the pyrolysis. And lastly are the hydrocarbons in the liquid form I explained earlier. They in turn go to the plastic resin producer, and as you can see, become plastic resin, which has the same characteristics as virgin plastics and can be used in any applications. So let's take one step back even further to the original process I showed you. The Nexus system on the left is the advanced recycling, the plastics that get converted to the hydrocarbons, and then they in turn get sent to the plastic resin producer, and the resins are in turn put into packaging, which the consumer then uses. However, what's different here is it can start over again into used plastics, and this can be done infinitely in a circular process. This is why it's called circular hydrocarbons. So what's unique about advanced recycling is that we can handle a wide variety of plastics. For instance, high-density polyethylene, like milk jugs, low-density polyethylene, like films, polypropylene, like bottle caps, and even polystyrene styrofoam cups. These variety of plastics are well-suited for advanced recycling. Unfortunately, the others are not. However, the plastics that we do take make up a large portion of the 79% of recycled plastics that aren't handled today. And further, Nexus has perfected the handling of films, which many call hard to recycle plastics. There are different forms of recycling. For example, only 9% of plastics are recycled mechanically today. 12% are actually incinerated. The other 79% is where advanced recycling can shine. But what's unique about advanced recycling is it's done at the molecular level. And for that reason, it has the same quality as virgin plastics, which can be used for any application, and it can be done infinitely. Further, the way Nexus does it is very economic, so it's highly scalable, and at the same time, reduces emissions. Advanced recycling can truly tackle the plastics challenge. Because advanced recycling has so many positive benefits, it really is an ideal solution to solve the consumer problem. And what is that? They are demanding recycled content in their materials. As a result, all the brands are getting pushed to get recycled content in, and they've set goals anywhere from 20 to 50% recycled content. They, in turn, are turning to their packaging companies and asking for that material, and those packaging companies are turning to the resin producers to say, I need more recycled content, who in turn are turning to us. As a result, this cycle is creating tremendous demand for advanced recycling, and Nexus is ideally positioned to meet this challenge. So advanced recycling is already ideal for addressing the 79% of plastics that head to landfill today. But what's unique about Nexus are three specific things. First, our system only heats once and cools once, and as a result, it's far more energy efficient, it's more environmentally friendly, and most importantly, it's economic. Secondly, the plastics we take in, we can take as is, without any pretreatment. A film we take as a film, a rigid we take as a rigid. If there's some contaminants in it, we can handle that. Finally, the product we make does not need any post-treatment by us or pretreatment by our customers, allowing it to run through the same plastics production infrastructure outlined earlier. Take all those things together and you have a winning formula because any innovation only succeeds if the technology works, if it's economic, if it's scalable, and you have a team to execute that. And that is where we believe Nexus is best poised to address the plastics challenge now and going forward.